Burger King, you're supposed to get it your way, but that's not what a local man says happened when he took a bite into his Whopper. A warning now, you may want to tune away from this story if you have a sensitive stomach. News 13's Kirsten Mitchell tells us what happened. Pretty upset, kind of freaked out. As you can imagine, I heaved a little bit, I think. The home of the Whopper was home to something far less appetizing Saturday. Turns my stomach a little bit. Brian Garman says he went through the Burger King drive through on Lizenby and 15th Street before he met up with some friends at a nearby comic shop. I was going in for about my third or fourth bite and I caught something out the periphery of my vision. And about the time that I got to here, I looked down and right next to my mouth was what was left of this roach. He took these pictures of a dead cockroach and called the manager. If there were roaches on their, their food line, I didn't want anybody else to get sick or, you know, have one in their food. He says the manager then put them in touch with their district trainer. They were very apologetic. They said they were sorry and they said they were going to have their, their corporate or their insurance company contact me. Um, and unfortunately, they never did. While he waited for their call, they offered him a refund. Uh, they offered me a, another replacement meal, which I mean, you know, unfortunately, is not something I'm really interested in. Garmin collected his refund of about $8, but wants more to be done. I just don't feel like that their corporate office is taking, taking this seriously. Burger King sent us a statement saying, in part, we can confirm this is an isolated incident and are working with the franchise who owns and operates this location, as well as our supplier to ensure our high standards for food safety and operations are being followed. In Panama City, Kirsten Mitchell, News 13.